Hey guys, how's it going? It's Johnny Five, and on today's EV show, we're gonna be taking a look at the update on the Dowsett Comet. Okay, so since the last time there was nothing in this car, um, now we have a complete battery pack. We have water cooling on all of the modules in here. There's eight modules up here four below it and three behind that in the back. And we have a separate water cooling system for the batteries and for the charger. And then the motor has its own water cooling system on a separate circuit. So basically I have all the cooling uh, going down to these two radiators and then we have two pumps below here on separate circuits. And the charger here, this is a 6.6 .6 kilowatt charger. And it has also a 1.8 uh, kilowatt DC-DC to give us 12 volts for the 12 volt battery. And that's about it up here. Let's take a look at the inside, inside the uh, cabin. So inside here, we have the other four modules below. Obviously the eight right here. And I don't know if you can see it or not, but we did end up engineering some uh, circuit boards so that we can transfer the cell taps to our BMS. Uh, so we had to engineer and build all those as well. Um, we have the contactor uh, fuse in here for the positive side. That always goes back to the rear box and uh, have all the cooling in here as well for the lower packs. And then we have these BMSs right here that two of them go here one of them hangs here to connect to all those boards so that we can monitor all the cells. And uh, let's go back and look at the back. All right, so coming back here, we have the last three remaining modules and that would complete the 15 modules in this car. Uh, we're just wrapping up the cooling on this one. So this will tie back into the lower box uh, toward the front there. And we have the negative side contactor uh, BMS in here, shunt, and a few other components to make this car run. Uh, and then that will be feeding through here, which is our high voltage fuse area. And uh, then it'll be also feeding to the, the motor lead in. As you remember last time, uh, this is our J1772 charge port that's been retrofitted to this uh, fancy gas lid. And that's now going toward the charger up front. So one final little fun detail back here is we threw a little ant symbol in there for uh, Ant Anstead since this is his car. Uh, thought it'd be pretty fun to do something like that. <laughs> All right, so that's about it for this update. And this is gonna be the final update for this car. Uh, after this, after we get done buttoning up everything inside of here and getting the motor running, it's gonna go back to Ant to get the interior put together and button up a few other things so that this thing can get driving. All right, so that's it for this one. Uh, thanks for joining us on the EV show and we'll catch you on the next one.